<laughs> this is going to be fun! I will stay here in the Middle Ages as Princess Leela. And I will go to the future and be Mila. And of course, I shall get more full. Well, Leela, he can't stay with you. I'm his human companion. And I promise to always take care of him. Oh. But I do have another idea. Really? Oh, joy, oh, joy! Ta-da! Oh, okay. Not quite what I was expecting. But one mustn't complain. Well, come on, no time to waste. Into the time racer. Oh, uh, um, uh, okay. Yeah, bye. Goodbye. Mila, Morpho, I need your help. <laughs> we are now the police car bandits. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know if... But I need your help. Okay. Come on, Morpho. Look, Stein. We are actually getting away with it this time. <laughs> Great job, Mila and Morphle. We are heroes, Millicent. Oh, no. There's a traffic jam. <laughs> Morphle, please help the kids get to the zoo. Morphle, morph into a bus. Children, have a wonderful day! Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Bye! Oh, no. Morphle, the garbage truck broke. Okay, morph into a garbage truck. Isn't it, Millicent? <gasps> How filthy! Did you see that, Millicent? This is too much. We shall return to our own time at once. Yes! It turns out that being you is not as easy as I thought it was. Such hard work! <laughs> Here you go! Two small robots as ordered. Perfect. What's that now? Oh, uh, nothing. Uh, thank you. Bye-bye. Have you brought everything? <laughs> yup. Perfect. Now, let's see if it works. Look, it's the bandits. Look, it's the bandits. No. This is going to work brilliantly. <laughs> Psst, Marvel. Mila! Where, where's your ball? 
Never mind the ball. We're going to play another game. <laughs> <laughs> now, come with me. Okay. Morphle, you came looking for the ball too? No. Oh, do you want to play another game? No. Oh, okay. Do you want to go home? No. Um, do you have any ideas? No. Hmm. Morphle, get those ice creams. Ha 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 ha. Mila, no play. Mila. You're acting very strange, Morphle. You don't even want to morph. No. All you say is no, no, no. Daddy, Morphle is being weird. Now, Mila, that's not a nice thing to say. Hey, Morphle, what's up? No. Uh, do you want some ice cream? No. No ice cream? That can't be right. Oh, no. I I'm so sorry, Morph. Hey, wait a minute. See? I told you. This Morphle isn't real. The, the bandit. bandit. Morphle, will you take a ball? Yeah, Morphle, you get the ball now. Ha ha. <laughs> oh, look at him. He's going to do it. Oh, hey, Morphle. Do you want to play? Ha 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 ha. Hey! Daddy! Over there! Oh no, it's Mila's dad. Play it cool, Yorn. Hey, Mila, what are you doing? Yeah, uh, you know, girl stuff. Psst, Morphle, over here. Well, okay then, you do that. Bye-bye, Mila. Bye, Daddy. Excellent, Yorn. Now for some more mischief. Morphle? Paint the wall. No. No. Give me that. Morph into... A police car. No. A fire truck. No. An elephant. Then... No. <sighs> We are building the tallest building in the whole city. But none of our cranes are tall enough to finish the project. Mila, could you ask Morphle to morph into a big crane? Morphle, morph into the biggest crane in the whole world. Amazing! Thanks a ton, Morphle. This is the greatest building this city has ever seen. I think you did super duper well, Morphle. Now let's go play in the park. Look! Morph back! 
back into a crane! Unbelievable! Where did that wind come from all of a sudden? I don't know. It's not windy anymore. <gasps> Look! than I thought. Up in my cloud castle, I'm always alone. We're very sorry. We didn't know that we built our skyscraper right through your castle. We will start over and build a new skyscraper somewhere else. I have better plan. I love my cloud castle. But up here, I have nobody to play with. For my plan, I need your help. How about a little bedtime story before you go to sleep? Yay, story time! Once upon a time, there was a little girl called Little Red Riding Hood. Shouldn't it be Little Blue Riding Hood? Uh, okay, sure, yeah. So Little Blue Riding Hood was walking through the forest to bring a basket of food to her sick grandmother. All alone? That's no fun. Uh, okay, she brought a friend. As they walked through the forest... Walking? Morphle, morph into a monster truck! That's way faster! What? No, wait! There is a wolf! Where are you going, little girl? Sorry, Mr. Wolf! We're in a hurry! Uh... Grandma! Oh, right! They arrived at Grandma's cottage! That's it? Grandma should live in a big Skyscraper! And there's a giant dragon to protect her! Wow! Okay, but the wolf is also there, and he... Gets hit by a UFO! Are you okay, Mr. Alien? 
Well, I am, but my ship is all broken. Now I can't get home anymore. We can take you there. Morphle, morph into a spaceship. Fine. They go to space and take the alien home. There's my home! But the wolf is right behind them. Is he riding a space shark? Uh, sure, but he is getting closer. Thank you so much for taking me home. No problem. Uh, and then they were back at Grandma's place. Ah, Grandma! Let's bring her the basket. Yes, finally. So, they bring Grandma her basket of food. Hey, you are not Grandma. Wolf! No, but you can't tell. The wolf has a disguise. Really, it's me. Grandma! No, your mouth is way too big. Okay, you got me. I am a wolf, and I'm going to eat you. But in a forest nearby, a strong and brave woodcutter heard the wolf. That sounds like a wolf. Don't worry, everyone. I'll handle this. <gasps> Stop it, you big bad wolf! Oh, no! It's the brave woodcutter! Looks like I saved the day. <laughs> hmm, what's this? Aha, I believe this is yours. Oh, thank you, handsome young man. But have you seen my granddaughter? Oh, eh, uh, Mila? Mila! Now that was a good story. Look, Morphle. Like this. <laughs> Marvel 2! Marvel 2! Don't worry, Morphle. You'll get the hang of it. But you'll never be as good as this little guy. Meet Boba, our newest magic pet. Boba loves blowing bubbles. He tends to bubble over with joy from it. <laughs> Whoa! See? That looks like fun. Oh, ah. Whee! <laughs> um, Boba, this is high enough. I can't get out. Morphle, morph into something big. Ah! What is... Ah, help! Help me! Marvel, help! Whoa. No! Oh. from the sky! Phew! There you are, Boba. Listen, 
You can't just blow your magic bubbles everywhere. It's causing lots of problems. Oh, not in my city. Daddy! Morphle! Can you pop my bubble? Phew! Thanks, Morphle. You see me late? I think uh, she went that way. whether I'd see my car again. <laughs> well, Boba, next time you bubble over, please don't take it so literally. <laughs> huh? Hey, cute little fella. It's so funny to think that one day you will be big and scary. <laughs> <laughs> With this sapper that we stole from Professor Racine, we can turn these animals into giants! <laughs> we are going to have a great day at the zoo, Morphle! Yeah! Mila! Morphle! The bandits are zapping all the animals into giants! We need to get the zapper back. Morphle, morph into a superhero. <laughs> You're zapped in. Uh oh, we didn't think that went through. We'll be back. Great. Now let's zap back all the animals. There, it's the penguin. Hi, 
Keeper Kenneth, we're back! Great! But... Oh! Huh? Oh, no! You have become really small. But you're still great animals. <laughs> Not in my city. Zap him with the hypno ray, Yorn. Follow us. Yes, sir. Morphle, morph into a giant robot. Stop Lawrence and Joe from wrecking the city, Morphle. <laughs> no, Morpha. Help them wreck the city. Okay, Mr. Bandit. Oh, no. Morpha turns evil. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> because of this hypno ray, everybody will have to do what we say. But how can we stop them when Morphle doesn't do what you say? <sighs> okay, here we go, Bandit Yorn. I'm sure it will work, Stein. Mom! There are two people here that want to tell you something. <sighs> if it isn't my good-for-nothing sons, I don't have time for the two of you right now. The president isn't going to blackmail himself. Tell her! Tell her! Your sons are the greatest baddies that I have ever seen in my city. They are truly bad baddies. What are you talking about? My sons have never been real baddies, and now they've even brought a cop to my house. Why, I, you two are even worse baddies than I thought. But... Mom, <laughs> tell us that we are great baddies. Yes, tell us you are proud of us. Stop it, bandits. Why should we? You are just a little girl without your red blob. Everybody, grab them. Huh? Why are these people following your orders? Did you hypnotize them? People shouldn't do what you say because you force them. They should do what you say because they agree with you. And for wrecking the city, you two are going to jail. My sons are getting arrested? Yes, Mom. We get arrested all the time. Oh, boys. The two of you are real baddies after all. <laughs> I'm so proud of you guys. Did you hear that, Stein? Yes, I did, Yorn. Yes, I did. The city looks perfect again, but come on, guys. It's time for bed now. No, Daddy. We don't want to go to bed. And you should only do what people say if you agree with them. <laughs> That's true. But little kids do what their daddies say. <laughs> Just daddies? <laughs> <laughs> 
and mommies, and school teachers, and the police officer, and grandmas and grandpas.